In this lesson, we're going to create a variable to track the player's score. So what we want to happen is whenever the player pulls a piece of garbage to the top of the screen, he will be awarded a point. Now the first thing we're going to do is create a new variable. So go to the data tab and then click on the first option, make a variable. And we'll be presented with this dialog box. Then here, type in the name of our variable, which is going to be score. Make sure the, uh, the option for all sprites is selected. And then click on OK. And two things you'll notice will happen. One is we get these new pieces that appear in our toolbox. And in our game area, our variable is displayed there. OK, now. We want whenever the player pulls a piece of garbage to the top of the screen, he must be awarded a point. Now the code that handles uh, the player dragging a piece of garbage to the top of the screen will be located in the garbage piece and right at the bottom here if Y position is greater than 140. Now all of these pieces of code will be run whenever the player drags a piece of garbage to the top of the screen. So all we need to do is add in a new piece that will give the player one point whenever he, whenever he pulls the garbage to the top of the screen. So to do that, the second piece in the data tab reads change score by one. Click this piece, drag it, and place it inside that if piece above, the, above all the other pieces. So above the hide piece. So this way, when a player pulls a garbage to the top of the screen, the very first thing that will happen is he will be awarded a point. So let's test this. Click on the green flag to start your game. And now try and catch the piece of garbage. Okay, good. It, we added a point. And if we do it again, we'll get awarded a second point. All right, awesome. The only problem is whenever we start our game, then the score remains the same. We want that whenever the player starts the game again, the score must be set to zero. So let's stop our game real quick. And we're just going to add in one piece that will take care of that. And that is the first piece, set score to zero. So we're going to drag this one and we're going to place it right on the top of our code. So above the show piece. Now once again, make sure that you are adding this piece into your garbage sprite. So when the game starts, the first thing that the garbage will do is set the player's score back to zero. 